Hi, this is Megan Hepner coming to you from the CHA show floor. I'm our creative editor at CK. I am currently in the Jenny Volan booth with Jenny herself. Hello, Jenny. Hi. Thanks for taking a minute to talk to us. Thank you. I just wanted to pick your brain about these amazing new stickers that you have. Thank because you. there's lots of buzz about them, and we, as the designer behind these, I'd love to get your insight, kind of how they came together, some of your favorites, anything sure. you want to say about them. Sure. Well, first of all, we started actually at Winter CHA, so earlier this year, we introduced our original banner stickers, which are kind of back here. And the whole concept, obviously, I know you know from your readers, um, the concept of banners is huge right now. Mm -hmm. And we had a great success um, with our original banner stickers. So um, just two months ago, so in May, we decided to introduce an, uh, four other designs. Oh, these look pretty. Yes, Reader's my favorite. Oh, I can see why. Yes. That vintage flare that you're so great at is so cute on these. Of course, they all come with the little alphabet stickers that fit perfectly inside of them, if you'd like to do that. But we introduced these four great designs, but we decided they don't, you can do a banner that's not the pennant point, and so we did the butterflies as well. Oh, yes. So cute. Great. These go so well with your butterfly accents, too. They do. Beautiful. And then we introduced stars at this show. These are fun. These will be great on masculine pages. Yes. Birthday pages. Yes. And I love the cream behind the alphabet. That's so versatile. You can use that on a bunch of stuff. And then we also introduced, in case you needed some, just a little push oh. behind it, you could get you could use the chipboard elements, so these are the pennant points, and then these are the ones for the butterflies. The stars will be coming soon. They're designed to fit right on there, They huh? are. You just pick the sticker up, stick it on there, and you can do a three-dimensional banner just like that. So when you're looking for ideas, Jenny, as far as like what shapes to do, where do you look? Or how do you come up with it? Because you always do it so well, and they always work so well on different layouts. Yes, everything that we do is vintage inspired. Uh -huh. So. So I would say the inspiration always comes from that. I'm drawn to stars. Stars are in our logo, so you tend to see stars over and over again. Um, butterflies are just hot now, so yes. um, that's just something. Anything if I'm doing a rub on, doing paper, I'm thinking, kind of thinking of butterflies right now. Of course, as you know, that'll change. Yes, <laughs> that'll change in a month, right? But for now, it's still popular, and so uh, yeah, just I think anything, anything I do comes from, as you can see, something old. Yes. A tin that I see, that's the color, and really, it's funny. You look at the tins, and those are the color bases for a lot of our lines: our red, and black, and green. So they really do support that vintage flair, huh? Yes. Well, how we call fun. it vintage fresh. Ooh, I like fresh it. Fresh vintage. Either way, it. we use it both ways. And it is so fresh. Your booth always is. Thank you for giving us some time. We sure love seeing Thank you. Thank you. Thank you, guys. Yeah, it was a delight. <laughs>